Hi Libra, this is your reading. Welcome to the channel. This is for Libra Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placement in their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So cross watchers, if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you. Okay, just because you are connecting with um, Libra, you're going to assume that whom I am describing here is you. Please don't. This is not a personal reading. Let me just put it here. So if the character here is a total opposite of you, then this is not you. Okay. If the situation, is, if the situation um, is not what's going on in your life, then this is not your reading. So Libra, if you're new to the channel, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And on the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click that link. You will be routed to my page. Tap in your question and then you click submit. So Libra, if you also want to know your lucky number and lucky color, um, for the week of September 15th to the 21st, I already posted that in Instagram. If you also want to know your financial forecast for the month of September, I already posted that in Instagram. If you want to be featured as our subscriber of the day, then send me a DM um, of your picture. We will going to shout you out or we will going to have a shout out of your picture um, in Instagram. Um, in this channel okay 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading so if you resonate with the reading congratulations if you do not resonate with the reading you can come back to the reading after a week or two time is fluid if you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading still congratulations for i am doing a collective reading libra let's begin your first card here is the four of cups and the eight of wands so i can see here that someone um either it's you or the cross watchers um is trying to hold on at the moment um i can see here or try it's the four of four of um pentacles is trying to hold back right but this one they felt like they made a they made a wrong move okay someone here explored someone here you know tried to connect with other people and that is a wrong choice because the people that they connected with um it feels like it's a toxic um so i can see here that there is a third party already and that is a person okay um that they are let's say it may not be intimate okay um, but it got contaminated by the four of cups um, I can see here that this connection right um, probably your person is not focused in this connection um, then they try to mingle with different kind of people try to meet with someone and they turn it back in this connection for you know um, for a different person that person is becoming toxic and someone here now their cups are contaminated someone here realized is that you stood out from from everyone that they met so someone here is also having a remorse that why did I left my Libra okay or my partner so again, this could be you, this could be the cross watchers. Cross watchers, if you feel like this is your reading, so be it. And Libra, if you feel like you are in the cross watcher side, that is okay. I am not reading which side you add. I'm reading the energy. As I can see here, someone is having a, you know, soul searching. What did I do wrong? Why did I left my Libra? Why did I it feels like I wasted time. I hurt the person. It's the remorse of leaving you behind. The mother of swords. Um, they want to go back. They 
will not take no for an answer. So there is a plan here of going back to you, of probably, you know, um, this is a person who will not go to, going to ask for forgiveness, okay? They have a remorse, but they will not ask for forgiveness. They have another plan. Um, Low-key, it's a, low-key, it's a more of saying sorry without you knowing. Um, they don't want their ego to, you know, um, to be at stake. The full card, okay. This is a move that they may, uh, that they made, and they didn't thought about it. It's a half bait. Um, probably the person were, you know, um, seduced, or there's an urge in them, you know, that they cannot control. That's why they turned their back and went to the other person. Um, they probably thought that the grass is greener in the other side. Um, this friend card, you might be connecting with a Leo or has a Leo placement in their chart or you have a Leo placement in your chart. As I can see that this person is, at the moment, if you're gonna talk to this person, it will, you know, you're gonna force this person's spouse. Uh, you're gonna force this person's mouth to be opened. Um, so what I can strongly suggest is let this person talk to you. Because as you can see here, if once they talk, they're gonna, you know, give you the flowers. And just be careful because there will be also a flowery messages, flowery words that you will hear from this person. Uh, is that, you know, is that a warning to you or you'd like it, take it as you will. So, Son of Swords, as I can see here, they're they will be approaching here like real real fast it feels like hey i want to talk to you uh, i want to see you and let's be together again that kind of fast movement as if nothing happens so i'm not sure if you're gonna like that um but i can see here that you will also wonder wait what you turn your back and now you want to come back as if nothing happened mm. there you go the emperor and the five of cups it went you know flipped but it's really here upright so they are sad right now you know they felt like i told you they felt like they wasted time probably this person you know really is moving too fast um with a full card you know this person is probably more of a person who's compulsive you know not really thinking of what they're doing or if they are thinking it's half baked they don't know or they didn't even kind of think what is the outcome perhaps so you might be connecting also with Aries or has an Aries placement in their chart or you have an Aries placement in your chart this person is not moving at the moment um, but they're missing you Okay. You might also be connecting with a Virgo or has a Virgo placement in their chart or you have a Virgo placement in your chart. As I can see that this person will take a while before they move. But once they move, it will run fast. Um, I can see here that this person will, you know, take their moment because they're gonna, you know, plan this going back. But... It takes time before that they will, you know, finally make a move. It takes ages for the hermit to finally be um, enlightened, right? Ace of Swords, Libra, as I can see here, that there is a promise of a victorious beginning for both of you. Um, let's check for the Four of Cups because now the connection is contaminated. Trust issues, right? Um, apart from the trust issues, I can also see here that, you know, the vase is already, you know, cracked, okay? The cup was already chipped. So you have to make a better judgment because this person will probably, you know, come back here like what I tell you, um, that this person might come back. Loki, they are, I mean, they... They have a remorse but they will not show it to you so they may come a little um cold here ace of swords is actually a repeat card that the universe is telling us that you're gonna have 
a victorious beginning with this person. I also want to know this Five of Cups. Um, the Hermit, again, it will take time for them to realize Queen of Pentacles, but they're going to give you this abundant new beginning. Um, they actually have this abundance um, that you are that you have been waiting for for quite a while now. They actually have this abundance that you've been asking for. They have the ability to give it to you. But at the moment, they are kind of like strategizing it. Um, they're kind of like trying to plan on how to come back without, you know, without the blame, probably. So this is your reading. Um, Libra, if you resonate with this and you want to go in-depth, you can book a personal reading with me. If you're okay with the reading and you just have a question or two or even in your personal life, then there's a link in the description box. Click that link. It'll be routed to my page. Tap in your question. Click submit. Libra, this is your reading. Um, click the subscribe button. Smash that notification bell. Comment down below. I'm very interactive. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be full reading. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you in the next video. Goodbye.